Kay, when you look at Mayor Buttigieg of South Bend, the former mayor of South Bend, Indiana, what explains his slip? You, you mentioned Ann Selzer of the Des Moines Register poll. Right. He was leading uh, months ago in that poll, but he has slipped since then. What has happened on the ground in Iowa? Well, I, I think we can't discount the fact that Bernie Sanders has been running for president in Iowa since 2015. Uh, he got about half of the delegates here in 2016, and he just kept a ground game here going. People, volunteers, door knockers, and so he has a really solid core of supporters here. Buttigieg, at this point last year, was unknown. People probably had a hard time figuring out how to pronounce his name. It wasn't until he had a town hall turn on CNN in March that he really sort of surged into the national consciousness. Um, the, the other thing about, you know, the close down and that electability argument that you were just talking about is that it's really unusual to talk to undecided voters and learn who their, you know, final two candidates they're sort of mulling. You run into a lot of people who are mulling Joe Biden and Bernie Sanders. That has nothing to do with ideology. That has total and complete, um, it's all about electability and their perception that one of the two of them is their best choice to beat uh, President Trump in November because of what they're seeing in the national poll.